What's up everyone, it's Hidbo TC, and the moment you have all been waiting for is finally here. Yes, that's right, we have reached 10,000 subscribers here on YouTube, which means I'm gonna do a face reveal. I'm also planning to answer some questions from the community and tell you how you can win your very own one-of-a-kind Mega Keg. Let's go. Now, before I reveal my face, before the big face reveal, I have to warn you, my face has been known to scare the toughest of pirates out on the seas. There's nothing I can do about my face. So if you have a weak stomach, my recommendation is to turn around, leave this video, ex close your computer down, and leave. It's not worth it. Now that the warning is over, let's count this down. Three. Two, one, ta-da! Yeah, it's that bad, guys. This is my face. This is all I got. And I, and I hope it's been worth waiting for. I mean, I'm so, I'm sure some of you instantly just left. They just like threw up, maybe. I don't know. This is my face. It's what I got. So hopefully, hopefully it was worth it. If not, let me know in the comments below. How, just let me know what I can do to improve this. Um, Cause I don't know if there's much I can do. Anyways, let's jump into some questions. Rep Raptor 98 wants to know, what was your first video game? One of the very first games I've ever, ever played was Asteroids over at a friend's house. It was awesome and I was hooked. See if these is best wants to know, who is your favorite Black Death crewmate? This one is super easy. It is Sharpie JC, of course. She's the star of the show after all. All right, he's got a follow-up question. What do you like most about your crew? That we are family. Sharpie is my little sister. Lobo is my little brother. Beardo is my bigger brother. Dernan is my brother-in-law. Jester is my cousin. We've been doing game nights now on Tuesday nights for about six years, and we are not stopping anytime soon. Atria wants to know, do you like pineapple on pizza? Yes. Uh, yes, I do. I I'm one of those guys that likes pineapple on their pizza. Next question. Soul Edge Hunter asks, what was the one thing that made you want to try Sea of Thieves? I saw a teaser trailer from Rare back in 2015. I think it was at E3. And what I saw absolutely blew me away. What they were trying to build, what they described, sounded amazing and I wanted to be a part of it. I was one of the first people to pre-order the game and I've been on the seas ever since. 123 Anthony123 asks, how long have you been on YouTube? I actually only have been creating videos for a little over a year. It's something I never really planned to do, but Lobo one day mentioned, hey Hitbo TC, didn't call me that, but yeah, Hippo. We should record our videos and share them with others. I think a lot of people would enjoy them. And so I started creating videos and well, here we are. LNT Gaming asks, do you like Lord of the Rings and the Tolkien universe? Uh, absolutely, 100%, yes. Yes, I do, I'm a huge fan. In fact, I just watched all of them, including the Hobbit extended versions. If you haven't seen them, highly recommend it. I watch them about every once a year, sometimes twice a year, the whole trilogies, uh, just because I love them and I have them and I watch them. They're great, they're amazing. Lord of the Rings. Ali Cheatham's son, Carter, wants to know, when did you become the cursed captain? Well, it has been a long time long time I've been the cursed captain so long I don't even remember and I'm kind of going a little bit crazy so it's been a long time probably since 1673 the year of the whale lord somewhere in there I think some that sounds about right Ali Cheatham's daughter Ashley wants to know what is your favorite tall tale Honestly, I've enjoyed every single Tall Tale. They all had a different flavor to them. I loved them all, but if I had to pick, it would be the fate of the Morning Star. The Snake Queen asks, what inspired you to become a YouTuber? It's honestly something I never thought I would do. I wasn't really ever planning on it. Like I mentioned earlier, Lobo was the one that kind of challenged me to create videos to begin with. Uh, so, you know, it's not ever something that I planned to set out to do. It just kind of happened. 
Um, but the experience has been amazing. Your guys' support along the way has been incredible. And well, here we are. So 10,000 subscribers in. I love it. And uh, yeah, I'm. that's good. Captain Iron wants to know, what do you love most about your community? Honestly, the people and reading interactions between everybody. Like I mentioned earlier, I've been doing family game nights for six years with my family and we have such an amazing time. That's probably why you guys enjoy watching. You're essentially watching a family play games together. And with that kind of purpose, I wanted to create a community that was family friendly, that created an environment where people could build relationships with others and have the same type of experiences that me and my family had. That, that's what I love most, that's what I love seeing. Momo224 asks, what do you do outside of YouTube? Well, my day job actually consists of video editing and creating motion graphics. I've been doing it for about 10 plus years throughout my life. It's been something I've always enjoyed, but professionally it's been for the last 10 years. And this question actually leads me into the next thing I'm excited to share with you. Now that the face reveal is over with, now that we've done this part, I'm excited to launch a whole new type of video on the channel. I'm calling them vlogs, but really what they are is I want to do tutorials, show you behind the scenes on YouTube, talk about branding, talk about streaming, talk about recording, talk about editing, talk about motion graphics. I want to give you guys the tools that you need that if you want to do this, if you want to go out and create your own YouTube, if you want to start streaming, I want to give you very easy steps, very easy tutorials on how to do that. We'll make them quick, we'll make them right to the point. That's my plan and I'm pumped for this next stage of the channel. Very, very excited. Now let's talk about this giveaway. In celebration of 10,000 subscribers on YouTube, I reached out to an Etsy store by the name of Nerd Propellant. This guy is amazing. He creates so many amazing things. But I wanted him to create something special for 10,000 for me. So I couldn't think of anything better to do than to create a unique mega keg, a one of a kind mega keg that you can win. It's gonna be gold, it's gonna have the Hitpo TC signature on the back. I'm pumped, it's, it's gonna be great. It's super easy to enter into this contest for this giveaway. All you have to do is follow the link in the description below. There's tons of ways that you can enter. You can follow on Mixer, follow on Twitter, you can subscribe here on YouTube. That always helps me when you do that. Thank you again, guys. I can't wait to see who wins this, but you have been all incredible and your support has been absolutely amazing. I can't wait to see where we are a year from now, five years from now, and you guys will all be a part of this journey with me. Again, thank you so much for all of your support. It really, it really does honestly mean a lot to me. I'm excited for the future, guys, and I hope you are too.